Hi, my name is Cyrus, also known as Giant Jigglypuff3, and I've been working on a Banjo Kazooie randomizer. Well, a lot of it's more shuffling, but I call it a randomizer anyway because it's subcategory, but whatever, it's beside the point. Uh, what I'll do is it'll shuffle around the Jiggies, Empty Honeycombs, and Mumbo tokens as one group. It'll shuffle the Jinjos, One Ups, and Miscellaneous items as another group. The, um, uh, uh, notes, eggs, and feathers as another group, and then the enemies, you can either shuffle that within the world or you can randomize what they are. There are a few more features, but let me go ahead and show you how to get this first of all. Um, I, here's my GitHub, and you'll see that there's a version 0.78 and a 0.76. Uh, there's not much difference, I just haven't tested 0.78 as much, and I know 0.76 works, so it's there. Um, you technically don't need this Python file. This is just to show you what my source code was. This is what I'm using. You can run that exactly the same. It's not a big deal. Uh, this uses the CRC tool, which allows you to modify the first megabyte of the um, ROM so that it allows you to run Because otherwise it says you're modding the ROM. Uh, configurations, I'll show you. Uh, <laughs> this is not needed. That's just a GitHub change. Um, here's some readmes if you want to understand what's going on. I do have instructions here as well. Um, and then some other stuff. Uh, the gifts are not necessary, but they're super cute. And then gzip is also required to uh, zip and unzip, uh, the, uh, sorry, compress and uncompress the uh, files. So uh, let me go ahead and download the zip file. And I'm going to download it into my desktop. I'm trying to put it in a place with a directory that has no spaces. So basically, every folder leading up to the file can't have any spaces in it. Uh, let me go to my desktop. And here it is. I'm going to go ahead and extract it here. And it'll just make a folder. I'm going to move my version of the BK ROM. I'm not providing this file. That's illegal. <laughs> and I'm putting it into um, the randomizer folder, opening it up. And you'll see all the files are there. All I have to do is run zero, a version 0.78. Uh, your computer might have uh, issues with this file specifically saying that it hasn't been downloaded a lot and might be a virus. I can assure you if you don't want to run this, you, if you have a Python IDE or something like that, you can actually just run the Python file and you should get the same results as long as you have all the libraries and everything that goes along with it. So let me go ahead and run that. And you'll see that this, this is the um, main thing. So. Uh, you can go here here and select the ROM file. Uh, just make sure that it's in the folder already. Uh, you can put a seed here if you want. Up to you, it's optional. Uh, I'm going to kind of leave it blank. Uh, this is where you randomize or shuffle all the options. I don't have anything for warps yet. I was planning on doing that, but uh, I'm getting a little stressed from making this, so I'm releasing as it is, and I'll get back to warps later. That's why it says none. Enemy says beta, because uh, some enemies uh, I was debating on taking in and out, and it's kind of weird how they work, um, but it ten this, this feature does work, so don't worry about the beta too much. You can randomize the order of clinkers rings, though I do warn you it is hard. I'll have a video of that later, and it'll show you that you might have to pause buffer to do that. The Croctus um, will change locations, but the cameras don't work yet, and I think it's a little more fun that way anyway. Same with the ancient ones. Um, the Jinxie heads are all around Jinxie. And uh, it's not, it's not it's all around uh, the Sandy Butt Tomb, and those might be in different order. Miscellaneous abnormalities, things that are normally weird, uh, I can also randomize those, but I don't have that in there. And on the possibility, it breaks the game. It shouldn't, but there's a possibility. Final note door says all the note doors up until the final Grunty battle are, cost zero, so you can just walk right through them. Uh, however, you can set what that final door is. And then all the other doors for like the egg uh, refill and the feather refill and stuff, those are also free. As for the uh, puzzles, you can go from 0 to 99, not 100, because if you uh, if I were to allow 100, you could not get the double honeycombs um, at the very end. So that one will always cost a minimum of one, but you can set how many puzzles you need uh, for the door of Grunty. Now, I also have a setting for configurations, and that's what this folder is. So if I click on here, it will try to open it up automatically, and if not, it doesn't. But I have default configuration, um, zero G, zero notes, any percent, uh, max rando, mean percent, which is what I'll be like showing off. Um, 
no rando beginner so basically it's the base game but it allows you to go through all the doors and practice whatever you really need um open layer no rando max percent which basically is no rando beginner but you're forced to get as much as you can uh, by the end of it and then uh rando beginner is just if you've never had a rando before i recommend doing this or right, not a if you've never done a banjo i guess uh rando uh, or I guess random in general depends. But I'm gonna go ahead and show you um, mean percent. So we have 420 notes that we need and 69 uh, jiggies that we need. And I'm gonna go ahead and say submit. You'll get a little icon with bottles. It says, "Hey player, even though we put a lot of effort into randomizer, I haven't had a lot of testers, which is uh, why I have both versions on there." <laughs> but it says these can possibly break. I have tested them. They haven't broken yet, but they can. Um, it'll say, let me edit your settings if you want, or you can go ahead and risk it. I say risk it. It should be working. You'll run it. Unfortunately, I don't have a way of showing that it's running in the foreground, um, but you'll see that this folder is being made, and you might be a little scared saying, what are all these files? Don't worry. This is what I do is I get a copy of your ROM and I put it into that folder, make all of my changes there. It'll eventually clean it up. And at the very end, you'll see a GIF if it works, like this one right here, saying, hey, your uh, seed was complete. And if you click on this folder again, all of those bin files that were taken out are gone. Now, uh, I'm going to go ahead and show you how to run this on, uh, well, I'm just going to run it on Project 64 just to show you guys what happens with it, and I will be right back. So you might be wondering why my screen looks blank right now. It's because I had to remove all the stream stuff, um, but let me go ahead and open the ROM. It will be on my desktop uh, under um, the randomizer uh, EPP IIISA, and that, there we go. There we go. Uh, let me actually raise the volume because I don't think you guys can actually hear the game right now. There we go. And let me lower it on my own headphones. There we go. This is desktop audio now. So yeah, uh, if the game starts the same. And you'll notice that in the demo, if it's randomized, you'll actually see it here. So that guy's normal, but you'll see that a bunch of eggs, the skeleton's not correct. Um, and let's go ahead and just run it for now. Uh, I like how the demo gets a little messed up because you're running the uh, rando. But uh, oh, I also, I recommend if you're on Project 64 to sync up the audio with the gameplay so that your game doesn't stutter. Because you'll have to do that every time. Let's go ahead and start running it. And I'm playing this seed blind because you guys, you guys saw that I was, um, let's actually hover over this so we can skip the initial cutscene, but I'm going to play this, uh, first playthrough of this seed because you guys saw me generate it randomly. And I'm not going to go for 100%, I'm just going to show off Mumbo's Mountain. But there is one change here in, oh, there's two changes in Spiral Mountain, but, um, and you'll see them pretty much immediately. So Bottles will say, you will need 420 notes and 69 jiggies to reach the top of the tower. Press B to get going. Basically, um, he doesn't tell you that this is a tutorial. I had to change the text so that it fits. Um, there's a ticker here, which is normally not here. Um, there's a sea goblin. Uh, some of the uh, Kali wobbles will stay the same. But that's fine. Kali wobbles are a little weird. In Mumbo's Mountain, I don't have uh, actually well, for for some of the game, I don't have everything randomized because they were giving me issues. For example, in Mumbo's Mountain, the uh, two Mumbo tokens. I'm gonna go ahead and listen to bottles. I'm not even gonna do the skip. Uh, the two empty honeycombs were giving me issues, and there are some stuff like that. But I, ho I hope you guys will figure it out on your own what isn't isn't randomized. We can go ahead and skip that. And normally we would have to go to the left for the uh, Jiggy, but I have the... F uh, just showing it's still there. That guy will not move. But the world is already open. 
because we're running the final um, puzzle feature. So we can go in. And you'll see that there's notes where plants used to be, uh, eggs. Uh, this Jinjo is not the right color. We can go ahead and grab him. This Momo token's vanilla. That's great. <laughs> Let me actually just go up here for a second. Now, uh, yeah, there's a yellow Jinjo. I'm not sure if you guys, how much do you guys remember of what I was... Oh, there's a seashell. <laughs> oh, the Jiggy's vanilla as well. I, th I think I randomized those. Let's hope so. Because then this demonstration would not make sense. Or I just got lucky. There's a Jiggy. So let me actually go ahead and learn this move first. So bottles are still the same. So he will still teach us how to do Beak Buster. Now, I'm gonna do my totals. And by the way, my background screen's just messed up because we're running on an emulator. Um, but you can run this on EverDrive as well, as far as I'm aware. Uh, you'll see that I have zero out of 10 Jiggies. And when I touch this guy, It will say I have one out of ten jiggies, and I trust your totals, uh, the, the the pause screen. I wouldn't trust the actual world thing. Uh, literally, these guys just got flipped. So, uh, how is this different from the regular route? So, besides like the fact that like things are randomly in different places, uh, for example, the orange for Conga will not be where the orange for Conga normally. Actually, it's right there. <laughs> There's the orange for Conga. So I actually did record more, but it just ended up being longer than it needed to be. So I'm going to go ahead and skip to the part where other people are playing the game and different levels, different stuff they're streaming it. Uh, please go check out all of them. They're such nice people. Uh, they get a little loud, so a little heads up, but I hope you enjoyed the clips anyway. Down here. Ah! What the fuck? He's following me! What? Dude, what the fuck? No, 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 no! He went in the what? He went in the wall, dude! Oh my god, I was not expecting that. Okay, we... I, I actually survived that, though. That was insane. <laughs> See how these rings go. Oh no! All the way over here. Oh, I'm well. Get my jump, but after this, I gotta go down there. Okay. Okay, see there. I'm gonna take the boost. Oh, <laughs> yeah. <Yep. laughs> I was like, what the fuck attacked me? <laughs> Yo, the termite, dude, he's back. Look at that. Yo, there's another one. What are you doing? Wait, no, give me my sled back! Please! Oh, come on, go faster! Go faster! Go faster! No! No! Damn it, dude. Camera controls. Wait, my camera's not working. Okay, um, I guess, um, okay, bet. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Easy, double renew. 
Oh, hey, a bird. Oh my god, a float sand. Get out of here. Holy shit! Ah! Get away! Oh my god. Holy shit, man. I'm not missing anything else in here, am I? No, that's just a token. Okay, we're good. Oh my god! Did it just follow me in there? Double kill! Oh, what was that? <laughs> I can't have everything.